Hello, Krista. Hello, Roberto. Thank you for joining us on Elevator Pitch. Thank you. So let's do this. My first question for you is, who is your Broadway icon? I think it's a tie between Kelly O'Hara, Stephanie Block, and Sutton Foster. Mm, powerful ladies. Yes. What musical theater song do you know all the words to? All of them. Duh. If you could travel back in time, what Broadway performance would you see? Opening night of Rent. So we have a bunch of Broadway show posters yes, here you at do. 54 Below. Which of these shows would you like to be in? Um, all of them, duh. But no, mostly, um, let me see, this one. Only if I can play the tuba, like Patty. This one, only if I can play the tuba, like someone else in that show. And uh, Katrina Lank. Mwah. Great choices, great mm -hmm. choices. So growing up, what Disney princess did you identify with? Um, it had to be Ariel. Um, I was Ariel for three Halloweens in a row when I was growing up. And uh, anytime I would sing along with the album, if someone else wanted to sing, I'd say, I'm Ariel. What are your top five favorite movies of all time? Drop Dead Gorgeous and the rest are just noise. So you have three projects in the works. Yes, three. Hercules, mm -hmm. Seared, mm -hmm. and your solo show at Feinstein's 54 Below. Yes, my first one. So, if you had two comps for all your shows, who would you give them to? Mm, well, my parents, you know, they have to pay to see a lot of shows that I'm in. So, I think I would just throw them to them. I'm sure that with three projects, days off don't come up uh, often. Yeah. But what is the perfect day off for you? Uh, I love spending time outside with my boyfriend, maybe picnic in the park. I would get the longest massage and then a gorgeous dinner with my friends. What's your favorite thing about playing Megara in Hercules? I love the way that she stands on both feet really strong. What's your favorite song to sing in your solo show? I have a duet with my dear love, Andy Mantis, that I'm looking forward to the most. Tell me, in your own words, what is Seared about? Seared is a play about a restaurant that is really wonderful but isn't getting people to come uh, eat there. And so I play a consultant who tries to get the restaurant a makeover and it doesn't really go very well. But we cook on stage. It's really exciting. Who are three women who have influenced your personal life? My mom. She's making a big appearance in this video. Um, and my friends from college, my friend Natasha, and uh, my other friend Megan McGinnis. Tell me, are there three women who have influenced your professional life? Well, a lot of them the same, but Megan McGinnis, Kirsten Wyatt, and Sutton Foster. What is the best advice anyone has given you? Other people's success is not your failure. Instagram or Twitter? Ugh, Twitter's the worst. Definitely Instagram. And would you sing a song for us? I guess so. Since I can't sing you a song from Hercules, I'm gonna be another Disney princess. Look at this stuff, isn't it neat? Wouldn't you think my collection's complete? Wouldn't you think I'm the girl, the girl who has everything? Look at this trove, treasures untold. How many wonders can one cavern hold? Looking around here, you think, sure, she's got everything. I've got gadgets and gizmos aplenty. I've got who's it's and what's it's galore. <laughs> you want thingamabobs? I got 20. But who cares? No big deal, I want more. I want to be where the people are. I want to see, want to see them dancing, walking around on those, what do you call them? Oh, feet. Flipping your fins, you don't get too far. Legs are required for jumping, dancing, strolling along down a, what's that word again?
street up where they walk up where they run up where they stay all day in the sun wandering free wish i could be part of that world what would i give if i could live out of these waters what would i pay to spend a day warm on the sand betcha on land they understand but they don't reprimand their daughters bright young women sick of swimming ready to stand and ready to know what the people know ask them my questions and get some answers what's a fire and why does it what's the word burn when's it my turn wouldn't i love love to explore that shore up Krista, thank you so much for that. And thank, thank you. you. Thank you for joining us today. It's been a pleasure. Come see Hercules. If you haven't won the lotto, there's a lotto standby day of. Also, come see me at my 54 Below show. It's my very first one, and I don't want to throw a party, and I'm no one gum. And Seared starts previews October 21st. So check it out. We'll see you then. Thank you, Ben. When's it my turn? Wouldn't I love? Love to explore that shore